How did you how did you digest the debate over the head? Like when when you were sitting in, you know in the hospital, obviously, but I, I don't know how much of it you were actually paying attention to. But it was a very fierce debate over the legality of it. How did you receive that? I think I have to answer that with the same way I did before. <laughs> I'm not I'm not going to answer. I'm not going to open the debate of ever uh, of what I personally think of the hit. I think the league, the league dealt with it. We gave out a suspension. It's done. It's over. I'm moving forward. But I'm not asking. Sorry, I'm I just want, I'm not asking you to tell me if it was legal or not. Just how you were feeling about all the talk that was happening and all the disagreement. Like, how did it make you feel when your face was broken and you were in the hospital? Like, I mean, how did it? It's not like whether it's legal or not. It's just the fact that there was such. Because people were blaming you, people were blaming Rafa, and it was just there was all, there was all sorts of weird kind of justifications being given for the hit. How did you take that being the victim of that? I think you're, when you're when you're sitting in the bed in the hospital, uh, the first thing that comes to mind is not it's not the, it's, you don't ask yourself the question. You just ask me. I think you're you're worried about other things. Uh, do you have a bleeding in your brain? Are you going to be able to, you know, what's the doctor going to say when he walks in? Um, that's the first thing that comes into mind. Um, that's fair. <laughs>